Paul Meyer came here last year, had a fall, a neck surgery. My total left side of my body went and gave away. Totally paralyzed left side, 60, 70% paralyzed right side, could not get up, could not hardly move. In 100 days, we got him to a level where he can walk with a cane and climb stairs. Went home after 100 days, uh, got home, I was home six days, and all of a sudden, I, I don't remember anything, but I collapsed. He had a pulmonary embolism, that means a clot in the lung, which is fatal most of the time, and a heart attack, which is also a fatal. I came out of it after 19 years out of the ICU, and I came back here for another 100 days, and now I've made a lot of progress the, the second 100 days, and here I am. Post-acute care center is a vital component in assisting older adults as they transition from hospital to return to home. They need to feel that there's a group of people whose job and focus is to get them back to what they were doing before that hospitalization. I only recommend to my friends and family uh, facilities that have physicians that are there every day. So if I know somebody well, if I can pick up that they're clinically changed just slightly, that's enough oftentimes for me to inquire a little more about what might have changed and that's really helpful for me um, diagnosing and treating medical problems. And you can't really do that if you're there weekly. I have a drawer in my desk that is filled with letters from families who are grateful for the quality of our therapy team, our nursing team, our physician's team, and quite frankly, everyone on campus. I don't know my limits many times. You tend to restrict yourself to how far you can go. He pushes just the right amount that I know I can always go further. If you can get the person or a patient back to what they were doing in life, that's called success.